So this video, we're just gonna go over the new version of my Simple Circuit version two preset synth pack. It's a free pack and all it is, it just simplifies the interface into a very manageable, easy to use, easy to program uh, synthesizer. The first row here of knobs is attack, decay, sustain, and release. And that is all the way across every preset that we have on here. So first off, I'm just gonna go over it really quick. So attack is the ramp up of, once you hit it, it's gonna ramp up the volume. If it's all the way off, then it's just gonna be an immediate hit. You'll see that right now. So the higher it is, the longer it takes to reach this volume here. And sustain is the volume. So you just imagine it, when you're holding it down or sustaining the hold, it's going to be the volume right here. So next we have decay. Now what decay is, is after it's done with this ramp, it's going to do a ramp down to where this is. So I'm gonna turn that all the way down and turn this up a little bit. Now we add release, that's another, that's the end ramp when, you're let, when you let go of the key. So if I want that to just keep playing, make it really high. So in general, if you want to do just a standard volume when you press a key, just turn up, sustain, everything else off. If you want it to fade out a little bit, okay, you just turn up release. Uh, if we turn down sustain, turn up decay, Well, that's going to make a pluck sound. And then if you want to do more pad-like things, bring up attack, bring up sustain, bring up release. So now the bottom row here, we are looking at the frequency LP cutoff. So it's a low pass. So it's like you'd imagine it covering up the sound. And I'm going to do that, illustrate that right now. Now, if you want to accentuate that, you just turn up the Q or the resonance. That's this one. So, if it's lower, it's going to be less effective. So, while we leave resonance up a little bit so we can hear that uh, sound, what we're going to do here is go over the last two knobs. Now, this one is going to regulate the amount that we're gonna send through kind of a ramp uh, of, for the filter. It's kind of a downwards ramp, more like if we had decay up like this. Um, so let's turn that up. Now, what it does is define how much we apply um, the filter to the envelope. Now this changes the decay of that envelope. So if you want it longer, you just turn it this way. If you want it shorter, you turn it to the left. So the amount and then the speed of that ramp. So I made a little pattern here. It's just a couple of notes. And what we're gonna do is switch through all the different presets. Now, when you're looking at page one, these are going to be the standard waveforms. It's gonna stop right here. Then these are alternate ones which you can mess around with different sounds using these two knobs. So it's gonna be a little different on those. Uh, on page two, it's gonna go from here all the way down to here. Now this is identical to this, except this is going to have two oscillators going and they're going to be slightly detuned from each other. So also, when you select them, they will have a different setting in the ADSR. That way you'll be able to tell easily which preset you're in.
Thank you.